This video has been made possible by Rebus Farm, the professional render service. Okay guys, well if you saw that unboxing video, you can't wait to see how the install will go and I can assure you it's uh, pretty easy, so well, let's get started with that, here we go. Hey guys and welcome back. Well, my apologies for the bright conditions, but in this video we're going to do the install of the card, the AMD Radeon Pro WX7100, and I want you guys to see everything as clear as possible, okay? So here we go. I got an additional phone right here to uh, record some details if you can't see it on the main camera. And that said, let's get started, okay? Now, first of all, I'm standing on a mat. It's uh, an uh, electro discharge, electromagnetic discharge mat, just to make sure that you don't have static electricity that will damage any of the components. And then what I did is I took off the side cover. So I basically just removed two of these little uh, screws here and slid it out like so. And that's all there's to it, okay? Now, I'm just going to use my phone here to record some details on the inside so you can see what's going on. Here we go. Right, guys. So, inside my PC, I am going to uh, put the card into the bottom white slot right there. All right. You can see by the bracket right here that it's in the open position, which is good. And I need to remove this back bracket here as well. Okay. So, let's do that. Okay, in addition, before I get the card in, I want to have some space to work. So I'm gonna take my cable here, which is the power cable to feed my card. And I'm gonna place it inside the card first so I don't have to do that later when the card's inside, okay? So if we take our card here and we have a look. And where is it? At the back here. You can see that it has a six pin connection right there. And I'm gonna look at my cable and find that connector as well. And there you have it, six, okay? So the clip goes on the top side there. So let me just see if I can get that in there, hang on. to fiddle around a little bit but that's okay I'll just uh, try to get a close-up so you can see there you go it's in there all right and then this guy is gonna go into our power supply all right so but I'll do that later so let's open up the bracket first so I'm gonna go in just gonna use a Phillips head screwdriver and let's open up that bracket here Just take the bracket out like so. And now we should be able to put that card into position. And it's, go, it's gonna go with the logo downwards, okay? So we're gonna move it in place into that slot. Let's make some room for our cables. And we're gonna push that in. There you go. And I'll just take my phone again to show you guys. Okay, so now you can see that the card is positioned in that white slot right there. And the bracket opening is now filled with our card. The power cable is here in the end. And the other end of our power cable is gonna go down in that corner over there, okay? All right, so let's uh, put that screw back in. Make sure it's nice and secure. So it's not gonna shake or anything like that. And then the tricky part is we need to get this power cable in. It's hard for you guys to see in here. I'll try and get some video on it. Okay guys, well, here's my power supply and down in the corner at the end there, 
try to get it in. You see that opening at the end right there? That's where it's going to go in, okay? I'm just going to get that connector in there. Well, basically that's all there's to it, guys. I'm not going to use the uh, the stereoscopic bracket here, but if I would, I would uh, open up another bracket underneath it, place this one inside, and this cable goes into a little slot right here in the corner, okay? So it's time to uh, close this guy up, and let's see what we'll do. Here we go. Well, thanks for watching, and before you go, please hit that MH button to subscribe, okay? See you guys next time. Bye.